How you doing? This is Yaakov with a beautiful idea. In the manner of this beautiful idea, may everybody be able to fill all of the places that they feel are lacking and they really feel that they're on the verge of also not only facing their reality but feeling good as they as they watch the only one that can fill them, that can fill us up, do so. Um, so there's a general blessing that we recite that uh, Jews recite over over um, over drinks and candy and uh, general fr- general foods, which is uh, a blessing that I'm blessing God, thanking God for um, who created everything, everything. So it's a very eye-opening preliminary. It's a it's a blessing that we recite before. We eat those foods, and then after we finish and we're satiated, we had enough of those foods. Then there's an after blessing that's very unique, and it's wonderful. And this is the chidush, the novel idea that God gave me this past year, connecting when I was in Uman for Rosh Hashanah near Rabbi Nachman's kever, his his uh, his grave, and it's very simple, deep, and you can use it every day to to help re- help you restart the day and help you in your restarting and to be aware of all the things that are going on because this is how it goes we say blessed are you Hashem our God king of the universe king of the world king of the universe who who created many souls Borina Fashot Rabot who created many souls Vechesronan and their lackings Let's stop right there. We just hit a very important part, and this is the part, only. This is really the part that is so important. God created many souls, many souls, and their lackings. Isn't that amazing? Isn't that amazing? We know God created everything. We know God created many souls. Now the kicker here is that God created us with our lackings. Okay, people may not want to hear that. I don't even want to hear it, to be honest with you. Like when I before I before I had this idea, I was I I, I personally didn't want to hear it. But just listening to this, let it let it resound. God created us many souls with our lackings. Meaning if you feel something lacking in your life, you're healthy. That's how God created you. That's how God created me. We feel a certain lacking. We feel a very important lacking. Now, one of my favorite rabbis, Rav Ufer Erez, when I was in Uman this year, he said, that's, that's our job in life. We have a lacking. Everybody has lackings. And the question is, where are you going to go seek the lackings? Because everybody wants to feel pleasure. Are you going to go search it from an unholy source or a holy source? And that's, and that's, really, and that's really the free choice we have. And, and to top it all off, let's see at the end of the bracha, the end of the blessing, what what the uh, what what the the righteous people that Sadiqim who wrote this blessing, what they have to say, and how they're going to educate us and how to fill it, because at the end of the blessing it says Baruch Chei He's the blessed life giver of all the worlds. The God, He is a life giver of all the worlds. The life that you feel and I feel lacking. In our lives, the things that we feel like we're missing is life. We feel like it's lacking in our life. Only God can do that because He is the life giver of all worlds, whether in this world or the next world. So first, He created us, many, many souls, with our lackings. It's healthy. We're healthy that we lack. But understand that no matter what you choose, God is the only one who can fill that lacking. He is the only life giver of all the worlds. He's the only one who can really give us long lasting, true happiness. When you're willing to be patient in your prayer and your learning and with yourself and your family and everyone, even all through all the mistakes that you make with all your lackings, God is the only one who can fill it up. And when you understand and put that point slip in your head, he created me today. I woke up today. I have lackings. That's fine. I just have to go ask him, the only one who can fill that cup, the only one who can fill that lackings, to help me fill it with his light, with his life. 
with the life that comes from him, and I'll feel the greatest joy in my life today. And may everybody merit to feel that great joy, to feel that love, to feel whatever's lacking, whatever's missing you feel in your life, it's only going to come from God. So first request from God, and let him do his magic, and be willing to put in whatever effort you have to put in, but understand God is going to give you the effort. He's going to give you everything. Just first request. First know that everything is going to come from Him. The real life you're looking for is with God. And it's not just some uh, some uh, nice uh, po poetic stuff, which is actually, it, it is in itself wonderful. But at the same time, the righteous people, we have what to rely on. When they're making this blessing, they're telling us the deep secrets of life, they're saying God created us with ma God created many many souls. We know on this earth you see many many souls, but create us with our lackings, and He's the life giver of all the worlds. So just request from Him, and you'll always come out on top, no matter what. Have a great day, believe, and achieve, and enjoy, and see all your lackings fulfilled, and filled up to the brim, in the best holy way with real life. Have a great day. Bye.